Life wasn't so easy when you were young and I was in my teens. I used to do things around for the neighborhood, uh, making money to have our spend money. <laughs> Since Jean retired, she's enjoyed lots of activities at the Senior Center. Uh, I never started playing support until I joined here eight years ago. It is a lot of fun. It can be very challenging. Oh! Jean also enjoys going to the casino. Oh, man. But she's really careful. She appreciates the value of money. I'm a family of six brothers and sisters total. And that, so we didn't get money very easily in our life, so we learned the value of a dollar. When you're on a fixed income, you can only have a limit to how much you can spend and how, much, how many times you can go. Oh, I believe there's probably people that go there day in and day out, especially that we've got them so close to ball, you know, in town now on that that they, you know, hop, skip, and jump, they're there. They go, oh, well, I can take money there, and you know, maybe I'll win today, but it doesn't always happen. We like it to happen, but it's not, it's not a sure thing. Just like the lottery, <laughs> not a sure thing. This is my casino envelope. This is to control what you're doing. Because if you, got, if you empty this out, you know you've done your limit, but this way you don't go in your wallet. You know this is my limit, this is where we're gonna be, and that's what I do. It's just like any, any other addiction that there is out there with the drugs, the alcohol. Ladies of Baltimore, only gamble what you can afford to lose. If you or someone you know has a gambling problem, call 1-800-GAMBLER. We can help.